Alright lads, how's it going? It is the show on my own, and today, this is my video on why Ma why Sheffield United are better off without Jay McCleverley. Now, if you don't know Jay McCleverley, he is an absolute nutcase. He's uh, Sheffield United skipper, he's captain of the Blades, which, skipper and captain, same thing, but, you know, uh, and somehow he managed to get the skipper, like, armband, um, by Nigel Atkins, how I don't know, it should have been Collins or Basham or maybe Sharp, um, but he is a daft idiot, he's done many stupid things for United, uh, like he gave away the penalty against Tottenham away last season, I do believe he's also the one who gave away the foul, which allowed Everton to score the free kick against uh, Tottenham at Barama Lane, that was a fantastic free kick in the back of that game as well, but you know lads, uh, Anyway, well, that's not exactly the point. That's just a list of dumb stuff. He's done mainly because United looks so much confident at the back without him. Like, if you watch the Donny match, we look so much better. Kieran Wallace uh, getting down the left hand side, whipping some balls, and McCleverley, he's daft like that. He doesn't, he doesn't think. He's clumsy. He, he, he reminds me of like Higdon, but at the back, he's just so clumsy. He give, he gives away stupid fouls for no reason. He gives away dangerous free kicks. He just gives them dangerous opportunities which could allow them to easily score. And McCleverley, how he's still our captain, I'll never know. He doesn't deserve the armband. I think personally it should be Basham, but oh well. Uh, but he's an absolute nutcase and I cannot stand him. But lads, that's been the end of the video. I hope you guys agree with me. And post down in the comment section below your opinions on Jim McCleverley. But lads, that's been the end of the video. I have been the sh uh, Sean Boyer one. You've been fantastic. And I'll see you later. Up the blade. McCleverly out, you scum.